you know, this is one of those movies, movies, it's only an hour and two minutes long. I can't really rant on it because it's one of those what did you expect. This is a film that is, one title is The Party of Kitty and Studs. And Stallone was out of work, homeless, got paid a couple hundred bucks to do this porn movie. And then when Stallone got famous, the, it got re-released and called The Italian Stallion. And you could tell they dub in some dialogue, which have that Italian Stallion monitor to it. And at points the film is so bad it's funny. And then at points that, oh god, I'm seeing Stallone's pasty ass and his Italian sausage. And a lot of women have a lot of hairy bushes in the 70s. Or what was that thing that Adam Sandler said in Bulletproof? How do you know it's a porno in the 70s if the guy's dick has sideburns? So I had a lot of hair in the 70s. It's so like, trim that shit. But I, it's like, what do I expect? I mean, the way I... It has this funny song at the beginning. You're the one who plays the game, Stallion. Oh, you're free. And Sloan running through the snow, slipping and falling in the snow. And it cuts to a woman. Like this weird stuff, like Stallone running through the snow as his song, You're the one who plays the game, Stallion. And then it just cuts to a woman naked and spread eagle on the bed. And then it cuts right back to Stallone running on benches in a jungle gym. He's standing on top and doing this. That's when he's like, it, it's, yeah, it's at times so bad it's funny. And then Stallone and this girl get naked in a shower and he's rubbing her tits with soap and both naked on a bed, fish kissing, just fish kissing. And you can see Sly's pasty ass and his Italian sausage and the woman has heavy bush. And while they're having sex, if you want to call it that, I'm like, they're naked and they're rubbing each other, but I guess it's sex. It's Sly smoking. And then, like, Sly smoking and giving some dialogue. And then it cuts to two women naked standing there with a fucking dog by their side. Just standing, looking, not saying a word. And then it cuts to Stallone talking and smoking some more. And then it cuts back to, like, these two women... Standing there naked, just, and a dog by them. I'm like, the fuck? And then this long scene with Stallone flexing his muscles in a mirror forever and doing this weird, I don't know what the hell he was doing, like this weird thing with his arm. I guess he's flexing or like, I'm like, is he ready to touch these people or what? It's like, and it's a mirror and in the background you see two women on the bed fooling with each other. And it's like, what? <laughs> and then you have the, his girl saying, I'm there to meditate to get my mind off stud. And then Sly goes off to play cards. We don't see him play cards. He, he just leaves. And then the girl starts dancing her by herself naked. I'm like, he just, she's just dancing naked by herself. I'm like, is this what people did in the 70s when you didn't have much on TV? You just danced naked? For those who live in the 70s, it's like, I'm just going to dance naked by myself. Is that how, how to have fun in the 70s? And like her dialogue, she says, a girl hasn't completed her education unless she knows how to lick a good joint. And the slide gets home, you find out that he lost his money. He's smoking again. And then again, randomly cuts to a girl outside showing her bush. And then cuts back to Sly, who gets pissed. He punches his glass, cuts his hand, 
And then this girl takes the hand and starts licking the bloody hand for a long time. Licking the bloody hand of Sly. She just licking the bloody hand. I'm like, is this a vampire movie? Because if this turns to a vampire movie, if this is a Sammy Stallone film that turns to a vampire movie like from Dustal Dawn, it would be the best movie ever. Well, no, but it would be a good movie. But no. But I'm like, and this goes on for minutes upon minutes, just her licking the bloody hand of Stallone. I'm like, what the fuck is this? Did this turn people on in the 1970s? Is this what people thought of as porn? Is people licking bloody hands? Is this how people get off? Or were people really into vampires more than they are nowadays? I mean, is this a vampire movie? Is this a prelude to Twilight? A love story dealing with vampires? Only with a lot of tits and ass? No. She just, for some reason, likes to lick his bloody hand. <laughs> they bandage it. About to give Sly a blowjob. Thankfully, you don't see any up-close shots or anything. Th I think we'll understand someone later took the movie and just put in some hardcore porn. That's not the version I saw. And then when they put in it, they said it was Sly, but it wasn't really him. So that's not the version I saw. So it's just, you get the idea that she's giving him a BJ. And then Sly going, be careful, you bit me last time. <laughs> and then I guess she does bite him, and he slaps her. But when I say slaps her, it's more like this. Ah. Ah. That kind of slapping, like. Literally, it's like slapping, but it's like stopping right there. And then starts whipping her with a belt. But it must not be hard, because he keeps whipping her on the ass. There's no red marks. There's no welts. I'm glad for that. I don't need to see that. But it's just it's like whipping her for like minutes. And I guess she gets turned on by this. And then they have sex. <laughs> and then it's all good and fine <laughs> and then they invite people over for this orgy and you have these weird shots like up close of teeth then up close of bush then up close of teeth then up close of bush Sly dancing with this woman and they're laughing they're smoking weed uh, two lesbian two women going at it I don't know if they're lesbians maybe they're both into both. You have this random guy doing this random girl. I'm like, who the fuck are they? And then they're all in this very small bathroom, drinking, laughing, talking over each other. They play with this folding mirror, like reflection thing. You have this guy eating a banana while getting blown and talking about horses. Yeah. Sly naked sly lying on three women and I guess in the, is this what sex was in the 70s you just lay and rub on people it's literally what it is it's not really sex it's just laying and rubbing on each other then they all get together just rub each other I guess that's sex in the 70s then they stand in a circle kind of holding hands and twerking and they go ring around the rosy they don't see it I wish they did, it'd be funnier, but they go around like they're in Ring Around the Rosie. And they do these weird like things with their face, like twerking. <laughs> and then they're on the ground. Sly and the girl get up. She goes, hey, wake up, slap Sly. Sly goes up, slaps her in the face, but yeah, it's one of those, it's a slap, it's like, like this. And then the end. And that's how it ends. I'm <laughs> so now you, I've told you the entire thing. You never need to see it. <laughs> so it's one of those. It, it's shitty. But it, it did make me laugh. You know, I'm sure that wasn't its purpose. But it did make me laugh. And yeah. I got blind from seeing Sly's Italian sausage. And pasty ass. But it's. It was a price to pay for this Stallone marathon. So, so yeah, I mean, I got some chuckles because it's like, what the fuck? Acid must be really, it really was prevalent in the 70s, wasn't it? 
or weed or both. But I mean, <laughs> no, I don't recommend or anything, but I guess if you're insanely curious and you want a good laugh at times for an hour, it's a it's a horrible porn and it's a horrible movie, but it's it's almost it's funny bad, I'll say that. So that's probably gonna be the fucking thumbnail is gonna be me doing this. Just like what the fuck? Yeah, oh man, I'm blind. So yeah. That's the Party of Kitty of Studs, aka the Italian Stallion. I got that fucking song stuck in my head now. You're the one that plays the game, the stallion. Or yeah, go watch the Cinema Snobs review of the Italian Stallion, and you can get the gist of it. Because he did a great job of it. But yeah, it... Fuck. Anyway, thanks for watching the start of Stallone Marathon. Hopefully you got some laughs out of some people. And next I'll see Rebel. Well, actually, technically, I did see Rebel. It was boring as shit. And honestly, the Italian Stallion was more entertaining than Rebel. So that will be a rant. And that's why I think I can't get mad at this. It's, it's shitty. But it made me laugh. And <laughs> It's a lot of what the fuck stuff. Like, what the fuck? So, thanks for watching. Take care. And we'll see you later. Bye-bye.